Michael Breen with EV West, and today we're going to give you a quick little walkthrough of the 1991 Toyota MR2 that we did an all-electric conversion on. I'm going to go ahead and show you some of the components under the hood and some of the components under the rear engine compartment, kind of give you a quick idea of the car, and then uh, we'll go for a little drive. All right, let's go. Okay, so here we are back at the engine compartment on our 1991 MR2. The great thing about the MR2 is it's a mid-engine configuration, which gives you really good balance between uh, by mounting the motor components between the axles. So in the engine compartment right here, we have our Elcon PFC2500 charger. It's a great little unit. It will charge at 110 volts as well as 220 volts. In this configuration, we're set up for level 2 charging with a J1772 connector and the gas pump. Over here, we have our 600-watt DC-DC converter. Down here in the corner, we have our Curtis 1238 AC motor controller. And on the back side of that, we have our EV West chill plate. So this is a water-cooled configuration, so you can do highway speeds and uh, all kinds of stuff without worrying about the uh, controller overheating. Down here, we have the HPVS uh, AC50 motor. Great little AC motor, super reliable. And that's hooked up to our adapter plate and our stock transaxle. Uh, we're using the stock five-speed transaxle connected to the stock Toyota clutch, and uh, it's a great little reliable unit. So now that we've looked at the engine compartment, let's take a look at some of the batteries. Okay, so here we are at the back of the car. Now the great thing about this conversion is there's really not much to see here. What we did is we recessed the battery box low enough that the customer has basically uh, maintained their stock trunk space. And this is great. He's got a uh, customer has a car cover and some extra cables and some uh, car detail and stuff in there. So there's really not much to show back here. But we want you to know that uh, half of our battery pack is situated in the trunk space. But we really haven't uh, sacrificed any of the stock uh, compartment, which is really nice. Now we're going to head up to the front of the car and check out the batteries up there. Okay, so here we are at the front of the car, and as you can see, there's not much to see. We went through a lot of um, work to actually maintain the factory look under the hood here. So we've kept all of our batteries, all the high voltage cables, connectors, and fuses uh, covered under the uh, factory look battery box that we put in here. Uh, behind the battery box, we have an electric vacuum pump for the brake system. The power steering is taken care of by the OEM system, the electric system in the MR2. And we also have an MESDEA RM4 heater pump. And what that does is it heats the hot water for the uh, passenger cabin to, uh, for environmentals on those cold nights and stuff like that, so you still have a heater. That's pretty much it uh, as far as the specifics on the car. We just kind of wanted to show the layout and do a quick overview of where all the components are. Now we're going to take a quick little drive around the block and kind of go over some more details on the car. All right, so here we are in our MR2. We're going to go for a quick drive around the block and show you a simple operation. Go ahead and turn it on. There's no starting involved. This is an electric motor, so we're currently on. We can go ahead and put it in first gear now. Just give it a little bit of gas, and I'm just going to roll it in. That's just good. This is an incredibly fun car to drive. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, it's real torque. You can use the pedal, and you can just feel it pull. And, uh, that's what we like. We like that instant torque. That's why we do this. We do it for fun. And uh, great little conversion. One of our favorite cars. Uh, plenty of torque. And we started out in seven gear. And the car's pulling real good. Let's see if we have a little fun in this thing, huh? Again, the great thing about electric cars is instant torque low center of gravity with the battery pack, and uh, I mean, fun to drive. All right, so that about wraps up our drive in the MR2. Just wanted to mention we have 38 cells in here. We're using the ThunderSky 260 amp hour cells, and the car gets about 100 mile range, a little bit more than that, but uh, I think uh, this particular customer likes to uh, drive it around and have fun in it, not uh, drive it so lightly. We really enjoy that. We like to have a lot of power versus range. Uh, go ahead and take this thing back to the shop now.